sorry. Baby, I'm sorry. Missed. Being so bad got me feeling so good. So maybe a lot of you females are getting more comfortable with your bad side, like your bad bitch side. You know, it's like, I'm sorry that I love myself now, or I'm sorry that I know my word, okay? Sorry that you bought a ticket that was a fugazi. Sorry that you got bamboozled. Way to kill such a bitter pill. Uh-oh. Let's see. Tell me about this person uh, that wound up getting hoodwinked or something in a marriage. So either this is you that realized that somebody that you were married to was fake or, or this is somebody else connected to you. I pray that it's magic and baby, I'm the bad. <laughs> okay. So there's somebody who is the bad bitch that got married to a fugazi. Fake or invalid. All right. Thank you. Uh, Leo. Uh, yes. Leo Scorpio. Um, or this is just some of you guys like realizing, this is realizing, huh? That you have so many other options out there to be happy, even if it's by yourself. Yeah, you know, like maybe you're... Yeah. I feel like a lot of you guys trace... Better walk that walk, baby, if you talk. So now a lot of you guys, whether you're men or women, you don't you don't care about what somebody says anymore. Uh, it's you show me and that's it. You know, I'd rather be with somebody who's mute that can actually show me who they are and what they'll do for me as opposed to somebody that just does a lot of this. Huh? All right. So let's see. All right. There could have been Trace Evan somewhere. Hmm? Resting bitch face. Who's this? Is this the person that was married to someone? This could be, I don't know, someone's realizing. So I see specifically now that somebody's realizing uh, that their marriage was an illusion, okay? Either it's a Leo or a Leo's on the other side. Cause the tables have turned. Uh-oh, this could have been a couple, a married couple that was coming after you. Something came back though. Something came back to bite whoever this part, it doesn't even have to be uh, a female. It could be uh, that this couple had a resting bitch face. Something could have came back. This could have been some more magic going back. Some moon magic. This past moon. This full moon. Yep. Ding. All right. Let me see what this. Surrounded by couples all the time. So there is. There's a couple that got exposed. What is this? Tell. Bet tell and balance. I feel like somebody can tell. Tell and balance. I don't know. Somebody could also tell that somebody was a liar by the by their balance in their their bank account as well. I also see that somebody um, was hoodwinked and bamboozled. Somebody could have wound up buying something and the and they don't have enough money in their bank account. It could have been literally because somebody was lying. They could have had like an alcohol addiction or they could have had a lot of other options. You know, this could be the type of a person that they married one person just to keep them because that was probably their crutch. The one that never leaves them. The one that always takes their side. Black. Okay, well, here we go again with that. I don't know why they're saying that. Or this, this could be somebody where, you know. Um, maybe somebody didn't realize that this person had a lot of other people on the side. And, and I feel like somebody, uh, for somebody, your, the bank account balance is way low, lower than it should be, but it's because they're finding out about somebody's addictions and stuff like that. All right. Now with the black and puncture, now let's get into that, I guess. Right. Ooh, somebody could have, um. Oh, uh, hold on. It just says Lenovo Black Friday. So there's, this is somebody who is, I don't know who's black. Who's on, who's the black person? Is this the person that, is this, hold on a second, hold on. Okay. So the person that you were married to could have had a resting bitch face if you're a female. Hold on. Someone who will share this feeling. You could have found out that somebody had a really bad mental disorder. That they wanted to puncture you or that they've punctured people's things. That puncture, they, I mean, they could have stabbed people. It could have been with needle. Somebody's mentally disturbed, and that's an understatement here. 
I don't know who this is, but whoever they were, I feel like you could just tell that they're miserable, married to their phone. What happened here? Something happened? Somebody, this could, oh, with the fake and the marriage, this could also be that somebody, this, this could be this also. So, all right, I see multiple things here, so just bear with me. I feel like people are realizing how many people with the fake and then the marriage have married people without their consent. This is getting exposed. But these are the types of people, though, where you can tell, right? If this person is always on their phone and, and, and what are they doing on that phone? You know, if they don't, if they can't even have shock, if they can't even have a conversation with me and they're on their phone, they can't love me. So maybe this is a lot of people who are realizing, I don't really want to be married. Like, why do I have to even get married? Like, who says I 12 o'clock exactly? Who says I have to get married, damn it? Maybe a lot of you guys are realizing that, you know, you're, you're an amazing option. You are not one of many options. You are the only option, and that's just that, okay? Somebody in particular, though, I got Scorpio and Leo. Somebody is maybe in shock that they're realizing that maybe somebody that they were married to was married to other people for other reasons. Somebody could have had multiple marriages. Hmm? What is this? Private eyes. I don't know if this is happening currently for somebody or if this is something in the past. Uh, okay. This could, hold on, hold on, tell me about this uh, private eyes watching you, please. Private eyes. Oh, uh, yeah, the police. Look at the police. This could have been a raid. There, were, there was a raid somewhere. Yep, that's them coming in. Knock, knock, 654. Knock, 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 motherfuckers. Hmm. What you gonna do when they come for you, bad boys, bad boys? What would we do without the good police, man? So grateful for you guys. So grateful for the good police and the detectives and everything. We, we, this would only be like, this would be like this without you guys, okay? With you guys like working with us, this shit makes it like balance. That's why it said balance. So thank you so much. Uh, all right. Let me put these back on then. Damn it. There could be even some people are going to be in shock. Of what they found out about somebody. Yeah, it's over. Someone was defeated. It's over for somebody. Now, this could have been a karmic couple that was coming for you because they were talking about couples in the beginning, right? <clears throat> I don't want to be right. Somebody, so it's like, I don't want to be right, but I know that either somebody's married to other people or, or there was a couple that was just people are realizing like, holy shit, what is a follower, not a leader? Let me get some letters. Let's get some letters. Hold on. Hold on. But that's just how I feel. Yeah, somebody's realizing that they were, um, I can't believe I spent all this time, man. V or O, this could be first initials. It's over too. I see over D or G. If we could be something for real. Nope, VDU. This could also be voodoo, just because I'm looking at intuitively. I know it's not, I know that it's not um, spelled that way, but that's what intuitively I got. I feel like some of these private eyes are in shock at how many people mess with this shit too. This could be that male coven, that cult that's getting exposed. Somebody could be realizing that they were married to somebody that was actually connected to a cult. Or this could be multiple people are realizing this. Like, I didn't even know this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Strategic. Somebody was very, very uh, methodical about the way that they did shit. I don't know if this is you. This could be you, detective. If you're the detective, you could have been very strategic about the way that this was going to happen. There was definitely a raid here. Thought I was strong enough. I guess this is somebody who liked it, liked to have control, right? Somebody wasn't strong enough to come up against either these private eyes, these police officers, you, uh, the spirit realm. I don't even need for that shit to be out here. I already know that that shit trumps all of us. Maserati. I got a flex. So these are some. These are some dudes that wanted to have nice things. But it's the way that they got them. A lot of these, a lot of these people had nice things off of somebody else's death. You know, this is definitely fake, invalid marriages. 
People are waking up to this, okay? The illusion is broken at how many people, uh, with the help of dirty cops, lawyers, and judges, were were marrying people without their knowledge. And then, and then what? You know, we already know, but let's just see September. Something may happen in September. Uh, yeah, justice system. The justice system was involved. I also, I, I feel like if, the, if there were any cops that were trying to sabotage, I'm going to show you, if there were any police that were trying to sabotage you or stop you, okay, from maybe exposing this, they're finished, all right, this is it, this is happening, there's something happening now where, you know, there, there's, uh, these could be retired cops, cops that are currently um, working as police officers, but something in September is coming and it's going to be big, I feel like this may be like something that winds up being public, the voodoo, the cults, the covens. The heavenly spirit. Yeah, something's going to come out. Like, this is going to be something where they're showing me um, in my mind's eye. You know when um, you're boiling something and then you can see the lid start to shake, right? Like pasta and you forget about it and it start. That's what they're showing me. So something's about to blow up with this and it's going to be all over. And people are going to realize how long this shit has been going on on September and winter. So there may be something that, that um, I wonder if they're warning us about something to maybe save money or just prepare. Hold on. Hold on. And hearing how your day's been. Do you think that you can tell me everything? You may be getting asked questions about this situation or some people are going to. I think that what they're saying is between September through the winter, this is what's going to be happening. It's going to happen over time where the justice system, this shit in the justice system is going to be coming to an end with these fake marriages, these life insurance scams. Um, so I don't know if it's going to wind up coming out slowly, but surely on the news or it's going, you know, something's going to happen though between September and winter. So there may be a situation where a lot of these people that did this, it's mostly men that did this, but there are women who did this shit too. Uh, like stay to yourself, be wary, don't get into relationships, like kind of just, I mean, I, I, I hate to say like isolate yourself, but I do, I feel like that's what they're trying to say. Like use your intuition. Use your intuition when it comes to like meeting anybody yeah, with these thieves and stuff like that, okay? Because I feel like um, the justice system knows that this is coming and this is happening. So I don't know what they're going to wind up doing in the process, but they're going to try and stop it. All right? They, there may still be some police officers or some people like this could be like dirty detectives and feds and stuff like that that are still trying to stop somebody to uh from exposing this yeah disembodied um these are people that you know what did we say that was again disembodied is like you're soulless right hold on a second instead i only wish you the best wow like wish you the best i mean this is going to be there there may be a lot hold on there may be a lot of people that winds up maybe that you guys knew. It's going to be like, wish you the best, you know, but you were warned that this was going to happen. You know what I mean? Like, you know, you were warned that this was going to come out. This is also my awakening card, right? To the illusion, huh? That a lot of people got their success. A lot of these people in the justice system got their success off of fake marriages and then life insurance scams. Hold on a second. Sorry. All right. Let me see what VDU is, though. Visual video display unit. Hmm. Yeah, be, be aware of this, you guys, man. Don't get into any relationships because it feels like desperation. 
Is that what this is? Video, visual, just clear that. Is that what a VDU is? Yeah. A lot of the, there's a lot more surveillance happening here. Beg, these people, somebody, somebody, these people are going to be begging. I don't know, man. Be, be wary of somebody, maybe, if you guys know about this stuff or you know information about this stuff and you know that maybe you're going to get interrogated if you guys, because some of you, you know, um, I feel like it's saying, like, don't let anybody into your life, man, because there are some people who are going to try creeping back into, into some of your lives because they know that you know some shit and they know that there's an investigation, a big investigation going on. A screen on which information from a computer can be shown. Some of these, oh, they're, okay, let's see. Wanted to torture you. Look at this. Naya. <laughs> Somebody could live in an efficiency where you're at. Policy from progressive. Yeah, somebody's got a little shame. Look at this. What a shame. Low down, dirty, dirty, shame. And if we lose our love, it's a shame. Sometimes I think I'm going insane. Um, power. Yes. All right. Somebody could be Latino. Latino. They're speaking in this commercials in Spanish. I would kill a hundred spiders just to be with you. I'd walk through an unshoveled driveway just to be with you. Why is this coming out, man? I don't feel like this is legit. I feel like this is, hold on. Lowe's knows what it feels to be, what it is to be a pro. There may be some people now that thought they were real good at this, right? Past, um, hold on a second. Yeah, somebody's going to try coming back to somebody here. And they're going to say something like that. But it's it's like to marry you. This could even be for some of you. This is somebody that you were married to. And they got a fugazi. They got a fugazi now. This person didn't appreciate you when you were around them. They never looked at you. They looked at their phone. You could have literally sat there uh, probably next to this person and said, Yeah, I'm going to go kill myself and our kids now. And they would be like this. All right, let me know when you're done. It's like feels like that. This person's weak. They're a weasel. I feel like what this is saying is I would kill 100 spiders just to be with you. Um, but I feel like when they get to you, they would kill you too. Coordinate. Somebody's trying to coordinate a, a way to come back to some of you guys. No, you're never going to get it. That's what I just, not this time. Never, never going to get it, my love. All right, yeah, because, um, all right, all right, all right, all right, let's just do it. Yeah, you are sacred. Hello. Hold on. Let's do it. Yeah, be wary. Yeah, be wary of this. A hug could be this heavy. 44 could mean something, but that's angels, butterfly. You may see, look at, look what's on the back of these cards. Dancing with my eyes closed. I still see you. Be very careful. Don't get back with any exes. No exes. I don't, I, you know, I mean, unless I, I, yeah. I'll keep dancing with my eyes closed. I feel like maybe this is you guys. Like, bitch, I'd rather sit there and dance by myself and know that I'm not going to be murdered for life insurance money. Clear that for me, spirit. Illusion is here again. Is this a legit? Yeah. Do not get back with any exes, you guys. Some of these people left you and and then and then um they got with somebody else. My phone just lit up again. And they don't like who they're with, or they didn't get anything out of that, and now this person is full of shame. Hold on. No. Stop sending me dingbat friggin' things about jobs. I don't need your fucking offers. I'm tired of you dingbats. I'm, all right, let's focus on this. They're probably just trying to distract me. I don't know what else that I can do. You remind me of me, and I'm my favorite person. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nope. I got Libra, and, and, and but the Libra and the chariot, this is a cop. I mean, this is either a cop 
or a detective or somebody that worked for the justice system that possibly is getting exposed for this. And they may they may know that you know about this or something like that. I, it feels like they want to sabotage you, but they're going to come in and talk sweet nothings in your ear. And that's literally what it is. It's just nothing. If you see butterflies, uh, or maybe you have a butterfly tattoo and that's symbolic for you for some reason, or you may just wind up seeing butterflies outside or something like that. This could be a spirit guide warning you. Tell me more about this. Tell me more, please, about this. Jumped. Oh, no, not again. Ugh. Again? What is this? Oh, here. All right. What is this? Oh, mafia. Somebody else might get jumped. Survey. Uh, please, uh, ooh, no, 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 no. Hold on a second. Is, is it surveillance? Clear that. Is this like survey, like surveillance? No, clear that. Is this like survey, like questionnaire? Clear that for me, Spirit. Clear that for me, Spirit. Somebody's going to try and have another person jumped. I don't know if you stop talking to this person. Hold on. There's rotten things left in me. Yes. Ooh. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Something is going to... Just don't trust a motherfucker. You can trust your girl right here. That I, prom I put my life on that. You can trust me. If you got a... a a few good men, okay? Or a few good rim Yeah, realm. Butterfly in realm. You may see butterflies. Somebody's going to try and... Uh, either, or somebody's going to be jumped by the mafia. What's this? Yeah. Uh, this is somebody that you were very loyal to. This could even... This could be a friend of yours. This could definitely be a greedy-ass friend. I don't know if this is abducted, but I'm sorry. I got to get some letters on who this message is for. Fall. I don't know if this is going to happen in the fall. This could literally be like the fall of the justice system as well. seems so damn unhappy tell me about this give me some letters please give me some um specific letters please for who this is for on on who needs to be wary about this please have my eyes so dark within me somebody's real dark but i mean that's pretty much all i expose here unfortunately f or m So this would be the person who it's for. If your name begins with the letter F or M. Mm. T or Y. M or I. Hold on. M. Give me, hold on a second. I'm sorry. I got to do this. Terry. Michelle. Specifically for a Terry and a Michelle. Uh, be wary of maybe you could have said something or found something out and somebody wants to get revenge on you guys. It could have been someone you're in a relationship or someone you're con connected to. Somebody could have been trying to hold on to your friendship or hold on to your relationship or they're going to try and say that they want to hold on or make things right. 
hurts when I'm leaving you. Yeah, this person, I feel like you realize that this was like, um, okay, that's what, that, yep, hello. Um, I think that you guys were realizing whoever this is for, um, there's something about you guys knowing your worth now. So, so, um, uh, somebody's going to come towards you or send somebody towards you to try to, uh, befriend you, but it's literally to get you jumped is what this is. Okay. I feel like you realize that you were holding on to like, uh, that you holding on to this person, whether it's a friend or a relationship or even a family member. Okay. Um, I feel like that you realize that every just this person being around you was bringing you karma, and it was like you noticed there were like struggles, or this person's always going through struggle, and, and it was affecting you. Ritual. Oh my gosh, this fucking hair. This is a bother. You guys get this? Yeah. Um, let me see. Ritual. Is this some people that did a ritual on you guys? Yeah. Okay. Don't 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 befriend anybody. If like if someone's like, oh hi, how you doing? But they may try to like um they may try to have conversation with you to make it seem like they're interested in the same thing that you're interested in. They could be trying oh, okay, they could be literally trying to get um your hair Hold on a second. Yeah. This is like bad though. This is them wanting to get like some of your hair or something, but they want to fight. They want someone to actually like rip it out of your head. They, you may not. So if you, if you stop letting people in your home or around you, cause you realize like they take, maybe you don't put your hair in the trash anymore, you know? Uh, whatever this is, somebody needs uh, your hair or some kind of DNA from you to do some kind of ritual. It's usually hair that they're actually willing to like start have you get into a fight or something like that. They they may get somebody to befriend you and then intentionally, intentionally like um, fight with you so that because it would be weird if somebody just came up and pulled your hair out of your head right so they this is how i feel like this is a tactic as crazy as it sounds but it, it sounds like someone's desperate to get huh. let me tell the truth you know what i'm thinking you see it in my eyes yeah so no I, this is somebody that you guys uh like nope done finute i don't want to talk to you no more every time i'm around you it's always a problem i'm always helping you i realize i'm just putting myself in deeper karma because i'm supposed to let you learn your lesson so it ain't working because i'm perfect and i know that you're worth it yep damn this is some like how dare you shut me out motherfucker I would die for you. Somebody's going to come back and say that. They're going to try, or they may have their friend say, yo, so-and-so misses you or something like that, man. I don't, I don't like it. I don't like this. I don't like this hold on. This is like double holding on. Like this feels like tying somebody up, like wanting to torture somebody, man. Hold on. Finding ways to manipulate. Yep. Somebody's going to try and figure out a way to manipulate uh, you, but this is worse than just mental manipulation. Hold on. Yeah, somebody wants to try and get somebody and then they want to torture them. It's only because you stop talking to them. That's it. Somebody's so butthurt over this, man, that it's dangerous. I feel like um, you're happier now that you're actually like just being loyal to yourself. Um, this person's like holding on to something that happened in the past, but you guys, man, they can't get over the shit. I can't walk away. That's what he just said. No. Constraint. Tie you up. Oh, God. You know. oh, I fucking hate these types of people. I do. I hate them. Are you kidding me? No. Are you kidding me? Is that another hair? Jesus Christ. All right. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to take the radiation out of my body after this. Let me see what FTM Urban Dictionary is for you guys. Wait. Female to male. 
trans. What's it mean in text? Yeah, female to male. Female to male. Is that what this is, man? Female to male. Female to male. I feel like I got hair all over me. Clear that from the spirit. Clear that. Is this female to male? No. All right, let's find out what this is, though, because this is important. Transgender. Yeah, it's fucking female to male. What what is this? Is this a transgender? I'm telling you, I hold on. Change my mind. Yeah, somebody's like, I changed my mind. I want to come back or hold on. Oh, it's fuck that man. Okay, damn. Oh, okay. Fuck that. All right. It could be fuck that motherfucker. You know what they're playing? Wait. Hold on. Did you know that I've got you on my mind? Yeah. At night, I think of you. I haven't heard this song in a while. I want to be a baby. Yeah, somebody really wants you to be like that, but I don't feel like you are. If you're a dude, man, somebody may wind up trying to come to you. I'm going to give my all to you. Clear that for me, spirit. Is this for both men and women? Yeah, don't take anybody back from your past, man, because somebody's going to try. Look, my hair's everywhere, man. I'm telling you, the radiation is killing me. Like my, my, I'm not killing my hair, but you know what I mean? I don't know if you guys are also experiencing this. Di diagnosis is what? Someone's crazy? Or maybe that's the diagnosis and they're right. Like that's the outcome. She's right. Don't. you my man. This could be for a dude as well. Tell me about this. I want you. No. Oh, me. Yeah, yes. Somebody could have been diagnosed with an SUV. Is I mean, I should <laughs> How dare you walk around with that Suburban hanging off your lip? <laughs> you got, you. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you walk around with that Range Rover? Is this diagnosed with an STD? They could drive an SUV. There's a reason I said that. Does somebody drive an SUV? Yeah, with the dick. That's my dick card. Clear that. Does somebody also want to come back and intentionally give somebody an STD? I don't know who this is for, man. All right? It's, but but there are some people that are so mad that some of you guys now, like, stood up and and you, you know your worth. And, and that alone will make somebody want to kill you. Unfortunately, you know, this person, it's like they, they want to keep you stuck and they know Somebody knows that, like, um, you got over something. Why aren't you? Why aren't you calling me like you used to? They're so used to you uh, texting or calling, or but I feel like you you went like ghosted somebody because you don't you knew that it was dangerous. You knew that some that there were people who are uh, marrying people without their consent. So uh, it's. There's there's people who now know about these cults, this male coven, because that's why I said it's mostly males, but women do this as well. But because we're finding out about the men doing it, primarily they have women that try to befriend women to for trust because they know people are waking up about this. Don't trust any of the women either. You know, just stay to yourselves. Let, let's see what the ancestors have to say. What, so tell me what else. Tell, tell us what else, please. So what what so what are you guys saying? I mean, I feel like I know what they're saying, but still. Look at that. Death. Please, guys. I'm I'm like your girl's begging you. Don't date anybody right now. This could be a Scorpio on, on one of these sides. With the constraints, you're not as easily accessible as you used to be. Death seven, that's spirit too. Tell me about this death, please. Diagnosis is you will wind up losing your life. Okay. Account. Tell me, tell me about this death, please. Thank you. Yeah, somebody wants to kill you. 
They want to kill you. This person also got into a relationship. They could have stopped and ended things with you where they ghosted you and then they went to go with somebody else. And now it's like, uh, yeah, a lesson. This is a lesson for somebody. Yeah, I feel like they left you out in the cold though. Or maybe you did, you know? I don't know. Maybe you did, damn it. This person is broke as shit though. They, they did something impulsively. You were the person that they, you know, that was a good person to them. You were a very rare person, very loyal person. You were loyal to somebody. Uh, that that I only wanted to hold on to you for some kind of control. What should we do with the broke propeller? <laughs> yeah, somebody's a broke propeller. You know, like just put it this way. Let's just say that you were flying on a helicopter and this person, you had all, let's say people were propellers. They're going to help you fly, right? Fly, pelican. And then you have one part, it's a broke, would you put that on your helicopter? I guess look at it that way. But I feel like you guys are already doing this and that's why. What would you do with a broke propeller? That's funny. The metaphor, the symbolism in that. It, yeah, the pro, they're going to send a pro or something like that? Yep. Look, look, this person thought that they were going to be happy. I feel like they sabotaged things with you, right? Left you like fucking possibly like damn near homeless or with nothing, Okay. And you healed from this shit. The Leo on one end, maybe. You healed from this shit. And they probably thought they were going to hear from you again. And and, and you don't. You, they didn't hear from you. And it's, it's fucking with some people, man. Hmm? Okay. Hold on a second. Tell me more, more about this. Hold on. Somebody could have been fired as well. They could have literally been fired from their job or or just, this ain't good. So you're single. Look at you. This is what I feel like. Uh, you're realizing that you're happier. Some of you guys are realizing the kind of gifts that you have. Like, damn, man, I forgot I like to paint. Huh? I forgot that I like to sing or I like to build shit or furniture. Whatever this is, some of you guys are realizing the gifts that you have um, but you're doing it because it's because you're by yourself and you're having a lot of alone time, okay? I just think some of you guys are like working on your health and everything like that. And of course, this is what happens, you know? Somebody, this sounds like a narcissist who lost an empath and then they think you're going to be all broken and shit and they'll come back. They're always going to come back and somebody or some of you didn't. And it's fucking with this, this these people because the worst thing, well, they, possession, somebody, somebody is possessed. Yeah, mm -mm. stay away. There's a lot of people though that did this ritual. These could have been people that actually did rituals on some of you guys and they need some DNA of yours. Nope, denied, DNA denied. Um, yeah, but this is somebody that lost an amazing person and they uh, are used to you always letting them back in. I keep letting you back in. No. Painful as this thing has been. I just can't be. But don't don't look at it that way. Just can't be with no one else. Nope. You let go. And I let go too. Because no one's hurt you me more than you. Remember that. They're going to try. Look. Available. Um, if you're not available to this person, whoever this is for, I feel like it's for multiple of you. They're going to try to force their way back into your life. This feels like people are going crazy. Do you remember when I told you guys that when, when all of these narcissists, when people start waking up about the intentions that are going on right now with these fake marriages and the life insurance scams and the police officers that are involved and stuff, then I tell you, they're going to start losing their mind when they can't get that impact, right? Nobody wants to mess with these people no more. They're losing, now they got to force shit, you know what I mean? They have to force it. Um, some of these people that um, got involved with this cult shit, they have to sacrifice somebody or they know it's going to be them. And they don't have the balls to do that because they're cowards for even getting involved with this shit. So uh, let me see if there's anything else. I feel like that's cool. I feel like those of you who know, you know, like, damn it, even if I have to like, let's just say that like this person in some way, like, well, they used to bring beer when we came over or they would have good weed. Who cares? Go without it. It's your life, right? Good that friendly spirit. Is there anything else that you guys uh, want me to say about this? No, this is pretty cut and dry for you guys. But I feel like if it's coming out here, it's because you guys are, you, you, you peep game to what's going on with this shit. So, 
It's going to make these people crazy. I think the reason why this is being forced is because so many of you are aware now and are awakened to what is going on. And um, you won't even like, you won't even make new friends at this point. Yeah, that's good. Keep it that way because the world's going to get real weird between September and the winter time. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be a crazy time energetically. So just keep planning your energy. Take your spiritual bass, play your frequency, sage, palo santo, whatever you do. All right. You can trust me though. That, you ask your pendulums. Ain't none of you going to, none of them going to say no. And for the ones who like to put my name in shit, right, and try to say I can't be trusted, 4040, you got something coming for you. Love you. Philly out nowhere. <laughs>